Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick, and today I'm going to be going over the Super Bowl Legends that were released. Uh, let's get out of that. I was selling my, uh, the Patriots players I no longer needed. The Team of the Week, Collins, Team of the Week, Edelman, and Team of the Week, uh, Chandler Jones. So, Super Bowl. Let's get the Super Bowl up here. And go quality, 95 to 99. And then I'll go all offense. Okay, so we'll go over the offensive players here first. Uh, it appears to me that doing that collection that gets you a guaranteed Super Bowl legend is going to cost somewhere around 200 uh, to 250k, I believe. Uh, so if you pull this Franco Harris, who's not a terrible card, uh, you will get um, 100k, which will be a loss. But it's actually a pretty decent card here. Of course, it gets bought out while I'm looking at it. Um, but he's going for around 100k. Uh, but he's got 92 speed, 91 agility, 93 awareness, 93 excel, 96 carrying, 94 block sh or ball carrier vision, uh, 87 elusiveness, and 99 trucking. Uh, let's just catching looking like he's got an 86 catching, so actually a pretty good card, actually pretty viable. Um, I'd actually think about picking him up if he got a decent amount cheaper. You'd have to get a lot cheaper for me to pick him up. Uh, next is this Isaac Bruce, which I, I, I'm i still debating with myself whether to pick him up or not. He's shorter than this than the Football Outsiders Dez. Of course he sells, but I gotta look. We gotta compare these stats because I gotta know. I gotta know. All right. So same speed. Better awareness, better catching. Dez has better spec catch and release. Bruce has better route running and better catch and traffic. Huh. It's going to be a tough decision. I might have to go with Bruce. I might have to switch it up. I've been using Dez and Megatron for a while. I sold Megatron uh, for Dion Branch, but um, I might have to sell Dez. I might have to run me some short wide receiver. Even though Dez is only 6'2", Dez isn't like a giant, but he plays like he's tall. I don't know. I'll have to decide on that one. If I if I make coins by selling Dez, I'll probably do that. But uh, next is the Dion Branch. It's going for around 190k. Uh, He's got 96 speed, 90 awareness, 97 catch, 97 elusiveness, 96 back catch, 98 release, 92 route running, and 98 catch in traffic. Uh, let's see. How, what's his run block looking like? Let's see. Uh, 60 run block. Uh, 87 jumping is pretty bad. Pretty bad. Uh, he's got a good spin and juke move. So all in all, pretty good card. Pretty good card. 98 release is really nice. What is Isaac Bruce's um, jumping? Okay, go up there and snag balls. 94 jump. All right. All right, Isaac Bruce. You might be joining the team. He might be joining the team. Uh, next is Otto Graham, uh, 98 overall quarterback. See, let me go down here so he doesn't get bought out. So he's got 89 speed, which is really nice. Uh, 95 throw power, 94 throw accuracy short, 96 throw accuracy mid, 90 thro 93 throw accuracy deep, uh, 85 play action, and 88 elusiveness. What's his carrying looking like? 85 carrying, so pretty good. Uh, and then one final thing. I think it's going to be down here. What's his throw on the run? Nice, 99 stamina, that's good. Throw on the run is a 95. All right, so Otto Graham, pretty solid card. You'll make coins off of him, I think, if you do the collection, or maybe break just even? I feel like he'd make coins. I feel like there can't be only, like, two cards that you make coins off of. Next is this John Elway, 99 overall. Uh, he's got 83 speed, 90 awareness, 97 throw power, 97 throw accuracy short, 95 throw accuracy mid. Uh, 97 threat accuracy deep and 90 play action, so this card is pretty beast. Uh, he's got 75 carrying, so not terrible. And let's see what his throw on the run is. What his throw on the run is looking like. He's got a 94 throw on the run, so another solid card. Uh, doesn't have the you could scramble with him, uh, but this John always is definitely a solid card. Definitely one of those that you want to pick up if you're. Uh, if you got a bunch of coins, definitely the quarterback you want to pick up. Uh, so next, we've got the Darnell Dockett, uh, 97 overall. 
Uh, he has a hundred power move. All right, 86 uh, speed, 98 strength, 95 acceleration, 85 tackle, 92 block shed, 100 power move, 78 finesse, and 85 play rack. Let's see, he's got 41 catching, but that this is not a huge deal. 81 jumping, so you can swat down some balls. Uh, 90 pursuit, pretty good there. Decent injury or de decent stamina, sorry. And uh, 93 hit power, so a nice hit power. You can force some fumbles with him. Next is the Tracy Porter, which is that how much he costs? Seems expensive. Let me see. Is that what he's going for? He is. He's going for 215k. All right. Well, I bought one <laughs> for like 180. So that's not that's interesting but he's got 96 speed 96 excel 92 awareness 94 agility 95 man 98 zone 91 press and 94 play wreck so a pretty beast card let's see what his catching is looking like 83 catching solid very nice uh 67 tackle uh 94 jumping but, um, 85 pursuit spec catch 73 catching traffic 70 a 66 hit power yeah but but not terrible not a terrible card right there for the uh the tracy porter okay let's go back to all defense since it seemed to be pretty accurate and then i think james harris yeah james harrison is the final card here he's going for like 350k and uh he's a 98 overall 89 speed 93 strength 95 excel 96 tackle 95 play rec, 93 block shed, 96 pursuit, and 80 zone coverage. So a very solid pass rusher who, with that 80 zone, you could drop him back or you could user him. Uh, 75 catching, so not terrible there. Uh, 85 jumping. <laughs> that 99 power move. 76 finesse. 97 injury, 95 st 99 hit power. What a beast. This James Harrison is a beast. If he wasn't so dang expensive, I might buy him, but he's pretty darn expensive for me to drop coins on him. Uh, but that's the Super Bowl Legends, guys. I'm still debating on whether or not I want to do that pack. I might do it just for you guys. Um, not 100% sure. Uh, the slot set right here that guarantees you a Super Bowl Legend. I'm still kind of iffy on whether or not I want to do that, but... You'll see it if I open one. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't. And I will catch you all in my next video, guys. Peace out.